from Brandy and Ray J to Kendrick Lamar and Baby King, family connections and music have always been a thing. Although most fans don't realize some of our favorite artists are actually related, having more than one superstar in the family sounds like success. The roots on these family trees are strong and bear a lot of mega celebrity food. In 1995, the ever-gorgeous Miss Megan Good began blessing our screens with her acting skills at just 13 years old in her first and now cult classic film, Friday. Her critically acclaimed role as the troubled teen Cicely Baptiste came in Casey Lemon's 1997's Eve's Bayou, earning Good her first NAACP Image Award nomination. From 1998 to 2001, Megan played Nina in the Nickelodeon sitcom Cousin Skeeter. In the early 2000s, we saw Megan's star power rise as she transitioned from child star into mature roles. 2003 was a major year for good. She landed roles in the action drama Biker Boys and the romantic comedy Deliver Us from Eva. In 2005, she played opposite rapper slash actor Bow Wow in Malcolm D. Lee's Roll Bounce followed by 2006's urban action drama, Waist Deep. Then 2007's Stomp the Yard with Columbus Short and Chris Brown. 2012 brought a spot in a who's who ensemble cast featuring Kevin Hart, Regina King, Taraji P. Henson, and Gabrielle Union in Think Like a Man, based on Steve Harvey's 2009 book. The hits kept coming with a starring role in the comedy Anchorman 2, The Legend Continues, a return to television in NBC's Deception, and the reprisal of her character in 2014's Think Like a Man 2. Miss Good stayed shining. Megan's latest on-screen character, Camille Parks, the lead character in Amazon's Harlem, a comedy following a group of stylish and ambitious girlfriends in Harlem, NYC, from writer Tracy Oliver of Girls Trip, is a hit. Good isn't only adding to her on-screen credits, she's making boss moves behind the camera. She started her own production company, Freedom Bridge Entertainment. Because it's challenging. It's challenging to be a black woman. It's, tri it's challenging to be a woman, you know? Um, I think that things are slowly but surely starting to change. And I think um, we've come a long way, but we still have a long way to go. And I think, you know, as it pertains to just people of color and the opportunities that we have in Hollywood, it's even harder for a black woman, you know? Um, so I, I think it's important that we do have events like this and we come together, acknowledge that, and don't let anything make us bitter, but make us better and make us more excited to be on the front lines of being involved in the change that is happening and, you know. She's flourishing as a producer and director. Talk about a triple threat. But if you thought the beauty and brain stopped with Megan, then you're in for a treat. Did you know Lamaya Janae Good Bellinger is Megan's sister? Lamaya is an R&B singer and actress with appearances in TV shows including Sister Sister, The Parenthood, Smart Guy, ER, The Parkers, Judging Amy, and films like 1999's The Wood starring Tay Diggs and Omar Epps. In 2001, the R&B group ISIS was formed by Lamaya along with Leticia Harrison, Ardina Clark, and lead singer Kiara Davis Martin. They had us grooving in 2002 with their album, The Way We Do, reaching number 55 on the Billboard charts. The album included the Hot 100 charting singles, Day and Night, featuring rapper Jadakiss, and Single for the Rest of My Life. Nominated for two Soul Train Lady of Soul Awards in 2003, the group took home one statue. In 2006, Lamaya decided to return to acting. Lamaya shines on screen, starring in the BET Her film, The Waiting Room in 2019, and currently on the BET Plus gospel drama series, King of Business as Essence. The good sisters have stayed 10 toes down, committing to their crafts both in front of and behind the camera. Their creative roots are strong with over 25 years in entertainment and showing no signs of slowing down. Megan and Lamaya are definitely doing a good job. These stars will never have to worry about being the only celebrities at the family reunion.